having a real breakthrough today. For the first time in months, I'm actually able to false grip over the rings slightly in my cross without having incredible pain in my elbows. And that means I managed to do that 10 kilogram counterweight hold more level than I've done any of the higher counterweight holds in a long, long time. So this is really, really exciting for me. I'm gonna progress down to nine kilograms counterweight now and see how we get on from there. That 5k counterweight hold felt really, really nice. I was pretty much level. It was a solid two second hold. So I figured at this point, I was finally ready to go back to attempting the iron cross with my full body weight. This was my first full iron cross attempt in over six months. <laughs> So the full iron cross isn't quite there just yet, but it was a really, really big milestone for me to actually feel the full body weight strain through those elbow tendons and not be worried that they were about to snap. I didn't really feel any discomfort in my elbows at all, which is really, really good news for me because it means that I can progress properly and it's going to be my strength that's limiting me rather than this injury which has kind of been hanging over me for so many months. My body weight's actually fairly high at the moment because ever since national finals I haven't been controlling my diet all too closely. So I'm going to be using the next couple of weeks to continue my normal strength training but also improve my diet, get on a bit of cardio and try to bring my body weight down as low as is physically possible, get every gram of fat off my body and then hopefully I'll be able to nail this full iron cross.